So here's Wilfred. The corpse is badly scorched. Are we looking for a fire type using murderer? Hmm. I'm thinking electric type using murderer, possibly. I think he might be throwing me off the scent there. Minute 37 seconds later. You don't think the chef did it? No, it occurred to me when I was talking to Watson. He uses the electric type, am I right? Yes, but we're looking for the fire type. Oh. You see it too. We were looking for a fire type Pokemon when we forgot that powerful electric attacks scorch as much as fire does. I knew it. I knew this was where it was going. Yo, what is going on everybody and welcome. I think, what are we on, part seven? I don't know. Should, should I just have a quick count and find out? I should probably work out these things before I go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, seven. Part seven. Jesus. Part seven of uh, Pokemon Snakewood. Let's play. And we've made it to New Moorwile. We got sent there by... Oh, who's the guy that's been following us around? Gleese. 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 Or something like that. I'll tell you in a second. If we just go up here. Because his name's going to come up right now. I should do what Gleese says. He knows what he's doing. He's a terrorist after all. Yeah, there you go. So we're following his advice. He sent us to New Moorwile. He's told us there's been a murder there. And uh, we're about to do an investigation to find out who's killing people. Dantaleon is going to take us this way. Yo, if you're enjoying this series, make sure you like and subscribe. Because I really appreciate it. And we will, you'll be able to see the rest of the Let's Plays that are coming up on this channel. Which, after this, I'm not sure where it's going to be. It might be Pokemon Black, or I might do a Resident Evil. because I've, It's been a while since I've done a Resident Evil. Anyway, let's carry on with the story. Don't tell it on. This girl here is the one Glee sent officer. He's a strong, intelligent trainer. So I'm sure she'll be able to help. I'm a member of the Hoenn Internal Affairs Army, acting as a policeman for the time being. The corpse is in the storage room, kid. Go check it out and search this place for clues. When you think you know who did it, come tell me. Find evidence it was them, a motive, and prove they had the means to do it, and I'll arrest them. Go for it. It's important for you to solve this mystery for the good of the people of Hoenn. So says Gleese, anyway. I'm off to guard the entrance. Okay, so. I'm guessing we can't get out until we solve it, because that guy says he's guarding the entrance. Yeah, there we go. So, let's take a look around, then. And solve this murder mystery. There seems to be a chef there, and I have bad experiences with a chef so far. It wasn't me. I'm a real chef, not a former one. Please believe me. Okay, good. That's a button that I can't press right now. Uh, there's someone interviewing somebody over there. What's it like to be rich and famous? What's it like to be famous? I can't really say, Gene. I've only just become famous. But it certainly is nice to be rich now that my son is number one. Hmm. I'm not sure about that. Number one in what? Watson had to give up on his plan to electrify the city. But now we live here, where all the electricity is born, so he's happy. Oh, I already think it's Watson. I already think somebody wanted to move back out to the city or something like that, and Watson's like, no. No, I'm happy here. Just a little blob on the floor here. It's a Heal Mardio! I don't have a healing machine, but let's see what my Heal Mardio can do. There you go, all happy and healthy. Oh, well, thanks, Heal Mardio. I was part of a two-man band, but my partner has left because be rich and famous, and I'm just left with my guitar case and a broken spirit. Hmm. Wiki hee hee. Who, kid, go away, I'm working. Okay. That's a bit suspicious, Mr. Scientist. I licked Nurse Joyce Heal Mardio, and now I'm so high. <laughs> cool. Go away, kid, I'm working. Okay, so there's a few scientists being a little bit sneaky here. I'm playing against a moron. Check me. Other man. No, that's my pawn. My king is this one. Fat man. Oh. Other man. Knight takes bishop. Fat man. Knights can't move like that. Other man. Yes, they can. In fact, that's the only way they can move. Fat man. Oh, checkmate. Other man. Do you even know how to play chess? Fat man. No. Say. I always think New Morwell is a bit cold for me. It's got, you've got, like, endless electricity down here. Like, if you've not got a radiator. Foo, foo, foo. It's another one. Okay. This is our storeroom. Poor Wilfred was murdered in here. Mind out, though, I think some Voltorb got in with our supplies. Okay, so these are Voltorb, so that'll be good. So here's Wilfred. The corpse is badly scorched. Are we looking for a fire-type using murderer? Hmm. 
I'm thinking electric type using murderer, possibly. I think he might be throwing me off the scent there. Blossom! Ha ha ha! Please aid the officer in his investigations. It's a terrible business. Just between you and me, Watson's electricians kind of freak me out. Chow ho ho! Go away, kid, I'm working. Mm. Okay. So, these Voltorb. Yeah, these Voltorb and Paralyzed Heels aren't here for no reason, are they? So, let's. See if we can't destroy them. Oh, and by the way, I did some. Uh, Ah, never mind. Did some leveling up in between, um, in between episodes. So everybody's looking a little bit, a little bit beefier than they did before. The only change in moves is that I've now got ancient power on Mar. <coughs> Excuse me, ancient power on Marley, uh, which he learned. Snake oil, ultra ball, nothing. Teleporter, thunderstone. <gasps> I've got a Thunderstone, and that's good because I've got a Pikachu, which means I'm going to have a Raichu. Very good. Right, okay. Let's just take a look at him again. Badly scorched. Are we looking for a Fire Time Murderer? Okay. So, um. Is there anywhere I've not been? Yeah, because I went up, I didn't go this way. Oh, wait, no. I don't talk. It's a bit strange. I'm confused. Yeah, because I went up that way, so this isn't... Yeah, these are people I'm not supposed to. Evidence most of means got any yet? Yes. The corpse is singed and burned. Looks like a fire type attack killed him. That's a start, but he doesn't get us any closer to unraveling the mystery. Plenty of Pokemon can learn fire type moves by TM or something. There aren't actually any fire type users here. Keep looking. Oh. Are we the last people left in Hoenn? No. Oh, thank God there are some survivors. Okay, so... I think it's the chef, I'm going to be honest. I mean, I generally have no idea. Um, let's see if anything changes. Song's going to be number one. Um, I saw this. You're nice, so I'll tell you. I saw the chef going into the storeroom the night that Mr. Wilfred got killed. Hmm, I'd better talk to the chef. Here he is. I have a witness who can place you at the scene of the crime on the night of the murder. I need supplies. I went in to get some honey. It was dark. I didn't even see the corpse. If it was there at all. Honest, I didn't do it. Do you have any proof? Here's the honey I got. Look. This is a jar of nutmeg. As I said, it was dark. I need to talk to the officer. Mm, that is strange. Mr. Officer. The chef seems the most likely. He was at the scene of the crime at about the right time. And as a chef, he would have a fire-type Pokemon to use as a portable oven. In fact, the Pokeball I saw in his pocket probably contained a Charmeleon. Whoa! That's real trainer knowledge there, Gleese. Did say you were... Oh, Gleese did say you were good. Okay, if you can find a motive, I'm solid. Why not ask Watson? The chef works for him after all. Okay. I feel like we're going to solve this. And we'll have to change... Well, we'll have to name our next Pokemon like Sherlock or something. Because we are officially detectives now. I love that little run. Here he is. Ah, you wish to speak with me? That's right, it's about your chef. We think he may have committed the murder, but we can't see why. Can you help us with that? Aha, I think so. I don't think he's ever liked poor Wilfred, to be perfectly honest. But why now? That I don't know, but I can guess. I've suspected it for some time. He's becoming a former chef. Surely he must be joking. No one can get in here. I don't know if anyone needs to. I think it might be like a disease. I see. Thank you for the time, Mr. Watson. Oh, I'm just doing my job. Okay. So now we think Chef's turning into a former chef. So let's go and talk to the officer again. Uh, also, just talk to Chef. Okay, no, can't say anything to him. Evidence, motive, and means. Yes. So you say the chef hated Wilfred, yeah? Wilfred, yes. So it seems the chef is the killer. What do you think? Is he the killer? Yeah, I do. Mission failed. Restarting. Oh, he's not the killer. Okay. Wow. Okay, so let's go again. You haven't actually been to look at the corpse yet, have you? No. Okay. <laughs> so it isn't the chef. So. Where did we start off before? We got the information from somebody that it could be the chef. No. We went to the corpse and then it was a fire type user. 
There we go. Say hello to her. Cool. So, there's a fire type user. We go down to this kid who said she saw the chef. No. Yeah, she said she saw the chef. I'm super duper confused. Uh, looks like a fire type attack killed him. That's a start. Okay. Now let's go talk to that kid again. Who said that she thinks it's the chef. There we go. So he saw the chef going in. And we talked to the chef. Says that she's got honey and went, went in to get honey or nutmeg or something. So let's talk to this guy again. Okay. Now we can go up to Watson. And then when, we'll have the same conversation. But when we come back, we'll say no. Uh, we'll say, do we think it's the chef that killed him? And we'll just say no and see what happens. Uh, okay. Yeah, yeah, he thinks it might be the chef. Cool. So... We go back to the officer, tell him he think it might be the chef, and then see what he says. Evidence motive means yes. The chef hated Wolf and blah blah blah. Oh, I pressed too quick. I thought there was more conversation than that. Okay, let's 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 very quickly whip through this again. For fuck's sake, this game's gonna drag. Uh, where do we get to the storeroom? Ah. Okay, so we're looking for a fire type user. Back to the... Ah, fuck off. Back to this guy. There we go. Talk to that kid. Wait, what? I thought that kid was the one that told me they saw the chef coming out of the stop room. Oh, no, this is here. Okay, cool. So, let's have a quick chat to the chef. So, back to the officer again. And then we go again. We talk to... Oh, what was his name? Watson. Yeah, talk to Watson. Come back down. We get in there. No mistakes this time, though. Talk to Watson. Come back to the officer and say no. And just see what happens. Can you help us? Blah, blah, blah. Cool, 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 cool. Back to the officer. No mistakes this time. No time for mistakes. There we go. Okay. Haven't spoken with me he's got any. Yes. So you say the chef hated Wolford? Yes. So it seems the chef is the killer. What do you think? Is he the killer? No. You don't think the chef did it? No. It occurred to me when I was talking to Watson. He uses the electric type. Am I right? Yes, but we're looking for the fire type. Oh. You see it too. We were looking for a fire type Pokemon when we forgot that powerful electric attacks scorch as much as fire does. I knew it! I knew this is where it was going. Yeah, but this is just conjecture. Is it? The chef said he was going into the storeroom to get honey, but he came away with nutmeg. So, the extent of the damage to the corpse couldn't have been done with an ordinary electric attack. It would have had to be powered up with a special item. And what do you use to power up electric attacks? Officer, electric honey! Do you? Are you just making this up? Precisely. The chef couldn't get any honey because there wasn't any. Someone had already used it to power up their electric attacks and kill Wilfred. Watson, but why? I don't know, but I'm going to find out. Right, you do that. Okay. Now, I feel like we've made, a, we've made some good steps here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to save the state. So that if we do something wrong, we can just come back without having to go through all that shit again. Um, so let's go back to Watford. Or Watson, or whatever his fucking name is. Watford? Watson! I know you did it! Watson. Oh, you do, do you? Ha <laughs> ha! It doesn't matter. I work with the Inquisition now, and I've been told that you can't be allowed to continue. Then I'll have to defeat you. Wa ha ha ha! You can't! My generator fills my Pokemon with electric energy! Fuck off. It makes them impossible to defeat! We'll see about that, dickhead. Gym battle! Oh, I should have powered up Raichu. I should have evolved Pikachu into Raichu. Why is it level 100? Oh my days. Do you think I have to... Do you think I'm supposed to lose to this, possibly? Because... 
obviously I'm not going to beat a level 100 anything ever. Well, at least it can't hit me with its dark type moves now. Or can it? Yeah, it can, but it won't be very effective. Oh, okay. So, I'm guessing this is one that we're just going to have to lose. Uh, and I'm okay with that. Yeah, well, let's just let it beat me. There we go. Oh, we got the <laughs> got the static off though. Good. So we white out. Where do we end up? Back in more while. He was hideously strong. I really need to find a way of weakening his power and turning off that generator. Okay. So that's done well for us because now we know we need to turn off the generator. Let's carry on up here. Okay, so I can't do that either. So I have got to go back there and take out the generator somehow. Um, did I pick up an item that was teleporter? No, snake oil. Heals all status problems, maybe. Spanner. Well, I could use, maybe I could use my spanner. Okay, well, first things first, let's do something that I probably should have done before I went into any battle anyway. And let's get this Pikachu into a Raichu. Fi Tai Hong. Here we go. And we have a beautiful... Raichu, look at that guy. Oh. Fi Tai Hong. And let's just have a quick look at him. Up close and personal. Still got the static, that's good. And he's holding a demon horn, which, by the way, raises normal type moves, which is why I gave it. No. No, that's not what that one does. That was for somebody else. I can't remember what the demon horn does. Yeah, that's a powerful dude. But it's no help unless I can work out how to take out that generator. Let's go back in and talk to this guy. What's well, in some you see, but surely if you shut off the generator. Okay, that's fine. But how am I going to do that? I'm thinking I'm going to have to talk to some scientists, probably. Uh, let's try this guy first. See, I think these scientists might be kind of in on it, so... Uh, go away, kid, I'm working, yeah. I always think New Marvel's a bit cold. I'm a bit cold, actually. I should put the heat on before I came up here. Go away, kid, I'm working, yeah. This is a shame. This is our storeroom. Voltorb got in the supplies. Mm, okay. Well, there's Watson. Let's not confront him again. Let's see what we can do. Generator glows with dangerous energy. It's plugged right into some Pokeballs. It's plugged right into some Pokeballs. Okay. I'm not sure... I'm not sure what it's trying to tell me with that. That... I've already defeated all the... Voltorbs down here, so... What is it trying to get at? directly into some Pokeballs. I feel like if I just keep saying it, it's going to, like, come to me. No. Okay, so... The orb facing one of the generator start. Ah, okay, so it was just that button. That button that I went on earlier that 
didn't do anything, but now does. That's fine. It's okay. Uh, let's go and take on Watson. Hopefully this time we will beat him. So, just to negate his electricity, even though I know he's got um, dark moves as well. We'll put Marley out. Hang on. Wait. You're psychic. <clears throat> so you're going to be weak to the dark moves as well, aren't you? Okay. Let's start out with Pisacha then and see where we go from there. Trying again, eh? Haha! -ha! You still can't beat me, don't you get it? We'll see now that your generator is off. My generator off? Whatever, I'm still a gym leader. I can win. Part 2. Inquisition Watson would like to battle. And he goes in with Shinx. Okay. Ah, it was a Luxray before. Interesting, his team's changed. Okay. So... Let's go for the bite. It doesn't resist yet because it's not a dark type. Oh, down in one. This battle just changed big time for you, Watson. Now he's got a Pikachu. Well, let's go Pikachu versus Raichu. Seems appropriate. And he's got a Pikachu. Okay. Let's go for the slam. Same levels. Ooh. He's going to slam me back. Oh. Oh, Pikachu. Oh, dear. Oh, son, you're getting bodied. High potion. Right, whatever. Oh, no. Oh, that's a shame. Man, I picked you. Next, we've got Jolteon. Oh, I love Jolteon. Uh, let's give Revenant a go. Uh, let's try Nature Power. I'm guessing down here it's going to be Swift, yeah. Yeah, that's fine. Under shot. Not very effective, so we can grind him down with nature power. Maybe finish him with a cut, why not? Oh, uh, he's using sand attack, that's what happened. Next, we've got lantern. Uh, are we staying? Because I think this cut. Ah, uh, no. Okay, let's swap. Uh, we're going for egg toplasm. Let him have a go. First of all, the grass whistle. Then the leech life. And the egg ball. Come on. Come on, Eggy. Oh, yes. Ectoplasm actually wins a battle for like the first time ever. Now, Revenant gets level 30. Ectoplasm. Oh, God, these level up so slow. Next, we've got Luxio. Okay. Uh, let's try Gyarados for this one. It's weak to the electricity, but. But. Oh, right. Goes for the raw, switches it out to Fitai Hong, which is probably better to be honest. Let's try an ice punch. Ice punch hits. Oh, it doesn't finish it off, and I'm guessing it's probably going to use a full restore. Hyper potion. Ah, oh, which means he's still paralyzed. Raws us again. Next win with Revenant. Uh, let's try fake out. There we go. Let's see flinches. Fake out misses this time. Roar again. Now we're in for Marley. So, Ancient Power. Goes for Bite. Ooh, because I'm psychic type. It does so much. Uh, let's try Sand Tomb. That's super effective. And it gets the crit, which finishes off Luxio. I think he had one more. Raikou. This guy's got Raikou. Okay. Let's stay in with Marley because Raikou is still weak against... Uh, the sand tomb. Oh god, it's a high level though. Let's try. Okay, okay. Obviously, it was always going to be quicker than me, so that was stupid. So, Pisacha. Let's think about this for a second. Right, sand attacks. In case I can't finish it with Pisacha, at least then we've got accuracy down, so somebody else might be able to do something. Right. I think we've actually done well there. So, quick attack hits this time. We go for the bite. I forgot I had leftovers on this thing, so that's useful. Bite again. Ah, and I flinch, but leftovers again. Mm. You know what? Let's just go for the tackles. I think actually they're doing more damage than their bites are. Oh, what a way to beat a Raikou. Tackle, tackle, tackle. 
And down goes Inquisition Watson. Thank you. Not possible! Mwahaha! That was improv Watson voice there. Irk, electricians, activate the teleport. Ah. No, he didn't. And that poor Raikou has been... Raikou he trapped has been released too. Ah. It's me, the officer. I'm on the intercon. I suspected they might flee like this, so I waited outside to where their teleport comes out and rested them. Thanks for all your help. No problem! So, there we go. Well. We've, um... We solved the murder mystery. Let's get a heal up. Cool. What's this guy got on? I was part of a two. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I was wondering if anyone's gonna like, you know, reward me. I don't seem to have a badge from that battle either, which was definitely a gym battle. Uh, so that would have been nice. <laughs> Sorry to upset you, sweetheart. Um, let's talk to the chef again, see what he's got to say, anything. I'm so glad it was proved I wasn't the killer. Yeah, I was trying to make you the killer as well. Sorry about that. Okay. So, wherever his teleporter went out to... Oh, wait, can we go in here yet? Or is that still blocked off? Clear off. No, okay, so we can't go there yet. That's fine. So, we can now go to more while, though, which is good. And hopefully, yes, there's a Pokemon Center here. There we go. Perfect. Um, okay. Let's look kind of time we're on. 26 minutes? Cool. So let's... Well, first of all, is there anyone in the bike shop? No. So, therefore, why don't we just steal a bike? You know? Like, there's no one here. Just take a bike. Now, I don't know where they teleported to, but I do have Surf, so... Oh, this is blocked off. Now, usually, there's just a body of water here, and you can surf across to get to the next area. However, that hasn't happened. Interesting, okay. So we can't go east from here. So I guess we've got to explore west and north. There's a gym there. Let's check out the game corner though. There's no one in here. You can't play if you don't have a coin case. Okay. Well, there's no one in here though. Right, just let me play. Just let me jump behind the counter and steal some coins. Right, okay. Let's check, let's check out the gym then. Obviously, this is Watson's gym. And. Ah, there's an Inquisition member up here. Footman! Got it! These are the badgers and TMs that Watson asked us to recover. Uh oh! <laughs> You're that kid the boss told us to watch out for! Well, I can't have you rescuing Glees from our base. I'll have to stop you. Look, son, you do that. Inquisition Footman is going to go out with Hombone. Yeah, I've seen too many Hombones in this game. But, thankfully, they're not that difficult to beat. So, we'll go for the annoying tactics again. Go with the sand attacks. There we go. And then we'll just finish it off with a couple of bites. Easy. What have we got next? Layer on. Ooh. Let's... Yeah, we can still stay in. It's not the best Pokemon to take him on with, but it's also not bad. So, we stay in. Keep grinding them bites off. So this is practically a gym battle, basically. Whoa, I have to tell my superior officers. He's run away. This is bad, they got Gleese. I'll have to rescue him. Hey, wait, that footman dropped something. It was TM34. This will help. Now I must save Gleese. Oh, so I'm not I've still not got the badge then. No. Damn it. Okay, so I've got to save Gleese. The problem is I don't know where Gleese is and where they've took him. So, oh, go away, go away. I know that by going north, we're going towards the desert. Yes, where we're supposed to be able to find our brother's last location. But before that, let's just go west and see what Route 17 looks like at the minute. 
I'm the daycare lady, we can raise Pokemon. Ah, so we still have a daycare. That's good. Um, let's put someone in the daycare. Because you never know, it could be useful. Preferably a male and a female that can have an egg, because that'd be fun. What's that? I feel like, what, do you think in Nose Pass and Joe dude could, could, could have an egg, do you think? Seems reasonable. What about these birds? Oh, yeah, I can have a birdie egg. Okay, so we'll put you on the team for that for now. We'll stop you for you, and then we'll put you there as well. And we'll just put you there. There we go. And we'll go and put these in the day kit. So you can have Scroofles, and you can have Wingle, and hopefully they'll have a little egg, that'd be nice. Um, and we can take back our team, and on we go. Let's just see if this guy's got anything interesting to say as we go past him. It's you, your Scruffles and Wingle are doing fine. They don't seem to like each other. Um, I guess that's not happening then. There's a chef there, uh, let's smash him up. Munchlax, standard chef Pokemon. Munchlax again. Oh, he's got six Pokemon. And its levels are going up. It's gone from 20 to 24. So I wonder if they're going to keep going up and this is going to get more difficult. Another Munchlax. 26, yeah. Good thing is it can't do anything against this, so I can just keep grinding it down with bites. Boring as that might be to watch. It's probably the best way to go about it. Uh, next, Gyarados. Uh, Draco Fury. And another. Easy. Curlier again. Stay in. Because again, I can two shot this thing with Draco Fury. Key! Cool. Chef fled. So we can take the berries. Keep heading west and see what west looks like now. Oh, this is a new route as well, so I can get an encounter here. Uh, and it's a Roselia. Okay, that's not bad. Um, let's just throw balls. Let's just throw Pokeballs. I feel like Roselia might stay in a Pokeball. Yeah, there we go. And we have a Roselia in the box. Shoot sharp thorns as projectiles at an opponent. The aroma of this Pokemon brings serenity to living things. Oh, that's nice. Give a nickname to Roselia. Uh, yes. Because obviously everybody gets a nickname. Uh, let's go for. Well, I don't know. What what do you call a spooky plant? Oh, I'm gonna call it Venus, like a Venus flytrap. That's quite cool. Oh, there's a oh, there's a dismembered head. Oh, it's a severed head. Yeah, it's just there. It's just there. Um, okay. Let's take on these zombies. Shrivel saw and polyworm. Nice. Okay, so we'll bite the polyworm. We will ancient power the shrivel saw. Shrivel saw. Shrivel saw. Oh, too easy. Well, I got a crit as well. That's good. Shrivel saw goes for leech seed. Ancient power. Not doing as much as I thought it was going to do. But that's okay because I think Bite will probably destroy it. We're all good. Everything's good. And why did I go for Sand Attack? Because I thought it was Sand Tomb on my other guy. So that's just made this thing a little bit slower, but that's okay. Let's try Psy Beam instead. Too weak to make a substitute. Psy Beam misses. Well, that finishes everybody off. They're going to crumble. Bye. And we're going to surf over here and see. Ah, great ball. I knew there'd be a hidden item there. I'm going to use Cut to get behind here and get this item as well. Revive. Could be useful. Um, I'm not going to battle these guys. I'm going to go down here. 
because I'm guessing that there's another hidden item somewhere. Repel. Good. I like repels. And nothing there. That's fine. Okay. So, ah, we can't go west. Vendant Turf. We can't go to Vendant Turf. Ah, oh, Vulpix in this route. Wait, I can catch it. I'm not just walking. Wait, come on. I don't want it. I want this thing. Calfby. Calfby. Calfby, because it's like a cow. Calfby, okay. Um, well, let's just throw a Pokeball at it and see what it does. I don't know what type it is. I don't know anything, so... Oh, it's got Horn Attack, though. Uh, and that was very effective. Let's try it in an Ultra Ball. Why is it leering me? Mm. It's got Fighting Type moves as well. Um, let's see if Ectoplasm's Egg Whistle can put it to sleep. There we go. I mean, we could probably hit it with a Tackle as well. There we are, yeah. Okay. Good thinking, Clarky. I'm gonna get the great ball in. Oh my god! This thing's a monster! Slaying the ball, man! Oh, you monster! That's just like again. Come on! Oh, come on! Calf B, you little shit! Got it. So let's take a look at Calf B and see exactly what the fuck he is. Calf Pokemon, obviously. Grows strong by drinking its mother's milk. If it grows too strong, it ends up vicious like its father. If it doesn't drink enough, it becomes lazy like its mother. If it drinks just enough, dot dot dot. Give a nickname to Calf B. This is strange. I feel like it can evolve into a lot of different things. Uh, yes, we're going to have a nickname to Calf B. Uh, and we'll call him. No, actually, I've changed my mind. Because it's a Pokemon that we've not got, I want it to be called by its actual name. Like a, like it's because it's not a real Pokemon. Uh, so that when it evolves, it stays as whatever name of the thing it evolves into. I'm trying to get words out, but it's not working. So with that said, let's get him on the team and take a look at him. And from there, we will wrap this thing up. We'll just get rid of uh, get rid of you for now, just so we can take a look at Carfby. Carfby. So, hustle trades accuracy for power. That's that's good in some ways. He's normal type. Uh, pretty well-rounded stats, to be fair. What's his uh, bashful nature? Horn attack, Leer, double kick, and headbutt. See, I want to have him on the team because I'm quite interested to know what he's going to evolve into. But. He's also not really very good. So, we're, we're going to put him away for now. Um, maybe I'll have a look on him, do a little bit of research, find out what he can evolve into. And maybe we'll take him. And let's just uh, quickly have a look at this Rosalie we've just caught as well. Natural Core heals up on switching out. That's a cool thing to have. S good special attack and special defense. Uh, not so good attack and defense. Speed's okay. Absorb Poison Sting, Sunspore and Growth. Yeah, so Venus is looking pretty sound as well. But right now, not quite sound enough for me to want to make a swap. So we're going to keep the team we've got. I think... Probably call it a day for this episode. Uh, what are we on? Like 40 minutes? Yeah, that seems about right. Thank you all very much for joining me. Hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, make sure you leave a like and subscribe. And you can follow me on Twitter. I've got a new uh, Twitter handle. It's at Your Saint Denial. That is Y O U R Saint Denial. Your Saint Denial. Because I'm yours, not you are Saint Denial. Because you're not, I am. Um, yeah, that makes sense, right? I don't know. Thank you all very, very much. And I'll see you all next time for part eight. And then I think after part eight, it might be time to start live streaming to get this thing done. Um, I'm not sure yet, but we'll see. We'll see. Thank you all very much. I'll see you next time.